Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Sex Talk with Sharonda. My name is Sharonda Parker, and I am your host. Um, thank you for joining me today on this 420. Because it is 420, the PPG store is offering our standard silver, silver ugh, my tongue tied. Our standard silver bullet is four dollars and twenty cents today, in store and online. Standard silver bullet, four dollars and twenty cents today here at the PPG store. So I wanted to start off by saying that. All right, so I have all different types of bullets that I'm going to talk about, but bullets are a girl's best friend. Yes, they are. This is our faithful go-to. It does not matter what other toy we have. We will always go back to the bullet unless you're like me and you done fell in love with the wand. It has been over a year or so before I've, since I've used the bullet because I have the wand. It's rechargeable. It gives me the same exact feeling that I'm looking for in my bullet, and it's really powerful. So I've really transitioned from the bullets because by the time you buy Unless you're getting them on sale, by the time you buy four or five of these a year, you done bought a one. So, this is what the standard bullet looks like. Okay? It's on a card. It's multi-speed. We can put it on the clitoris. We can put it on the nipples. We can put it on the nuts thing. We can suck dick with it while we're stroking the dick, playing with the nuts with it, on the head of the dick. We can do so much with the bullet. The bullet is one of those toys that... You know, it's a it's really a, a introductory toy because it's real inexpensive. But at the same time, you could get a whole lot going on. So when a woman comes in the store and she says, I've, I've never had a toy before, the first thing we're going to show her is the bullet. So these bullets are $4.20 today here at the PPG store. But this uh, live is about bullets in general, stimulators. Some people want them to look a little more fancy. So we have the gold bullets. These are not on sale. Okay. And then we have the pink bullets. Literally, they have the exact same function. They just look a little different. Okay. But we do have them here in stock at the store. All right. Then we have the double bullet, which is the reason why I want to talk about this live. We have the egg. We only get these once a year during Easter time because these are the golden eggs. But we still have some eggs in stock. All right. And I just wanted to bring them because I want you to see that they do come in different shapes too. But the double bullet is the reason I was making this video today. Because I was looking at my old video from the double bullet. And I was like, you know what? It's about time that I did an updated version of this double bullet video. So... Let's talk about this double bullet because it's April showers and we're talking about G-spot stimulation. This is the perfect time to talk about the double bullet. The double bullet is for couples, okay? So this is going to be my vaginal canal, okay? Now we all know that the G-spot is literally right there. If you stick your finger in, the G-spot is right there. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this double, well, one of the bullets from the double bullet, and we're going to insert it in right there. It ain't got to go far. You ain't got to do no lot of pushing. We're going to put it right there at the beginning of the vaginal opening. You see that? All right. We know that the G-spot is right up here at the, the roof at the top. We know what the G-spot is, okay? What he's going to do with his dick is... He going to go in behind the bullet and that's called chasing the bullet. So this is what it's going to look like inside. You're going to have the bullet at the top. I want to make sure you can see it. And then you got his dick right up under it. Okay. Of course, his dick is going to be bigger than my finger, but I'm doing this because I want to show you what happens. Okay. So the bullet is going to wedge itself into the Kegel muscle, mean, meaning it's going to push up. You see how that's pushing up like that? Now you got his dick up under. So he's going to be thrusting in and out. And you see that movement up and down? As he's thrusting in and out with his dick, that bullet is going to be hitting up against that G spot in the inside. Just like that. Can you see it? Let me know if you can see it. Give me some feedback. Okay. Now, this bullet is on a cord. 
We do not want to do this with a wireless bullet. This bullet is on a cord. So that means that we can retrieve the bullet when we are finished. You can't do that with a wireless bullet. So we don't insert wireless toys inside of us. Okay. So again, we have this bullet. Dick pushing in and out. Bullet hitting up against the G spot. You squirting everywhere. Now y'all saying Sharonda. You still got another bullet left over. This bullet in the inside is doing what? So what this bullet on the outside doing? Well, we got some options. We got the dick inside, right? The bullet inside. We could take this bullet. Remember I told you this is the vaginal opening. You got this bullet in the inside. You could take this one and lay it on this top part and stimulate the clitoris from the outside while you're stimulating the G-spot from the inside. So we got a bullet on, we got one bullet inside, another bullet on top, on the outside, stimulating the clitoris. Yes, we can do that. Oh, you, you about the crawfish, because you got one bullet in, you got another bullet out, and then you got the dick inside. That's a lot going on. But this is April showers, right? You do want to wet the bed, don't you? Okay, we're going to make it possible. So we got one bullet in, one bullet out. Another thing we can do with this bullet, I'm going to show you this because I want you to see how much length. Now, you can leave it tied up if you want. Now, I got this other bullet. Now, mind you, this one is in. This one here, we can take it because keep in mind, we bust open, legs open, the bullet doing what it's doing, he doing what it's doing. Our hands are free. So we can take this other bullet and we can reach down and we can stimulate our ass. Or we could go a little further and we can stimulate his nutsack. Or, or you could take this bullet because you got one down and you can pull this other one up and you can stimulate your nipples or you can stimulate his nipples. Suppose you are riding. So what you're going to do is you're going to insert one bullet in. You're going to sit down on the dick and start riding. Now keep in mind, you got this one inside you because you're riding. Now you still got this one here left over. You could take this one and you could stimulate his nipples while you're riding. Or you could stimulate your nipples while you're riding. Or you could reach back and stimulate his nutsack while you're riding. It's a lot of different things that you can do with this double bullet. But this is the double. Suppose you say, well, that's great. What else you got? We got the triple. Triple bullet. Now, triple bullet, you can take. Again, you got one inside. The dick inside. Hitting up against the G-spot. We got another one on the clitoris on the outside. And now we got another one for our breast or for his nuts. And all of that's going on at the same time. So bullets are a lot of fun. Bullets allow us to be very creative. The only thing about bullets is, because I always tell you the pros and the cons to toys. Bullets are going to be one of your least expensive toys, which means that because they are on a cord, Bullets are the toy that short out the most. These are not lifetime toys. That means that if you decide to invest in a bullet, understand that you'll be buying them throughout the year because they tend to get shortages more than any other toy. Okay? Now, your standard bullet, it is not waterproof. Okay? But this double bullet is waterproof and this triple bullet is waterproof. My people who are in the swinging community, meaning you're dealing with multiple partners, triple bullets are perfect for you because you can stimulate everybody involved. Okay? Again, my couples, the double bullet is wonderful for you. And then I have the, the standard bullet is for anybody. It's just that you could do the chasing trick with the double bullet Whereas you got one bullet in and one bullet on the clitoris. Now, you can still chase with the single bullet, but you're just going to be stimulating the G-spot from the inside and nothing will be stimulating the clitoris from the outside. Okay? 
I hope you all enjoyed this live today. You all always remember to be kind to people. I was just having a conversation with my husband this morning. And the one thing that I was explaining to him is kindness goes a long ways. We can say anything that we want to say, but I was always told it ain't what you say, it's how you say it. Okay? So we want to always remember when we are dealing with people, especially in the public, especially people that we love, have romantic relationships with, any type of relationship with, even your animals, you can handle them in kindness. You can respond in kindness. You ain't got to be nasty just because you woke up today. That is one of the things that I was talking about in my wife's school to some of my ladies. And what some of the single women were saying that they have this little attitude about themselves. And it's just how they are. And my thing is, it can be just how you are. But if it's something about you that you know ain't right, and you know you just a nasty person for no reason, I'm talking about behavior-wise, those are some of the things that you should want to correct. You should want to be kind. When people meet you, they should say that it was a pleasant experience. When people meet me, I always try to give them the best version of myself. I honestly believe in doing things with the spirit of excellence. And even when I greet you, it's going to be, hello, how you doing? Welcome to the PPG store. How can I help you? In other words, I'm going to give you exceptional customer service. If I'm coming to you in your line at the register, I'm going to say, hello, how you doing? How's your day going? And it's not about me being fake or phony. It's just that when people come in contact with you, you don't know just that little kindness can turn their whole day around. So as women, as ladies, remember I was teaching y'all about that Proverbs 31 woman, being a virtuous woman, being a woman of high standards, operating in a high vibration. You should operate in kindness just because you want to be like God. In other words, you, you want to be the best version. If anybody met me, I want them to say that, you know what? I felt like when I came in contact with this woman, she was a good God-fearing woman. She was a virtuous woman. She was an honorable woman. Yeah, that, that is how we should be conducting ourselves on a regular basis. We should not be all mean, frowned up. I deal with it all the time when I go, especially when I go get food and different stuff from places. People just angry. But the thing is, when you know better, you do better. So you don't have to walk around being angry because guess what? You woke up today. So that's enough in itself to be grateful for. All right? Operate in kindness. Do things with the spirit of excellence. You all be blessed. You all be safe. Shop on the website. The website is listed down below. My YouTubers, like, share, subscribe. And if this video moved you in any type of way, feel free to send a tip. You all be blessed. I will be here at the PPG store. Happy 420 to you. I am looking forward to meeting everybody that walked through the doors today. You all be blessed.